Hi ladies and gentlemen, today we're fishing in Washington on the Snake River with guide GL Britton from Double Spay Outfitters. And GL is a great guide, we've fished with them before. GL, what do you expect us to catch today? Oh, I think uh, we'll have a chance to catch some fish, hopefully. It's uh, steel heading. This year has been uh, gotten off to a slow start on the snake. Our water temps have been higher than normal, but if we stay persistent and keep our heads in the game, I think we can at least get a hook up or two. Well, let's give it a shot. Sounds great. Got something. Fish on. Got a steely. Yeah, I heard this commotion. I looked downstream and Steve's got a monster steelhead on. Big fish. Yep. That was a pretty cool take. It's just that slow grab that GL was talking to us about. They don't do uh, a sharp pull. It's, it's kind of a slow pull on your line, but it's heavy. Wow. <laughs> That's nice. That is really nice. That was a huge jump. Oh yeah, it came a couple feet out of the water. I don't know how many, how many pounds, but it's a pretty big fish. And I missed it. This fish jumped once early on, but then just a huge jump in the middle of the fight. Of course, Lad missed it, but. After what seemed an eternity, Steve brought the powerful steelhead near. Wow. But the steelhead okay. continued to battle. Finally, Steve managed to land the fish. Look at that beautiful steelhead. That spay fly right in the side of his mouth. That was awesome. Yep. Okay, it is a wild, at least it's got a adipose clip, so I'm gonna leave it in the water. What a gorgeous, gorgeous fish. Yeah. Probably six pounds, maybe, something like that. I'm thinking so. Okay, there he goes. Finally did it. First thing in the morning. Yeah, beautiful fish on a spay fly. I think that's my first fish on a spay fly, maybe. Woo! All right. <laughs> oh, Steve, I think you got a Chinook. <laughs> yeah, and he hasn't he hasn't shown himself. It's a Chinook, I'm pretty sure. But he feels, you know, feels pretty heavy. Nice fish. Oh, look at him go! <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Good one. What a fish. One good. Yeah, don't put too much heat on him. You don't want to. Yeah, he's about <laughs> done, but not done. I don't like you. Very cool. Yeah, I can see the big old spot. That's going to be easy eight pound fish. That's, yeah, that's special. Very nice. Beautiful. All right. Thanks, GL. Job. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, GL's been telling me that uh, being first through the hole is really the best. But really, I think what I'm doing is getting the fish all stirred up, and Steve's been coming around behind me and catching all these fish. This was the first time uh, in my guiding or personal experience down here where uh, someone's taken a steelhead and a Chinook in the same day, which is kind of now becoming the Snake River Grand Slam. Uh, I mean, you might be able to throw a sucker in there, but I don't think we're real interested <laughs> in that. But uh, so to get the two game fish in here in the single day is the first time I've ever seen anybody do that. So yeah, pretty cool. You know, I, I might be being paranoid that uh, GL and Steve are hanging out a lot together and uh, I think he's putting the best flies on his pole. I'll have to pay attention to that. <laughs> best pieces of advice I can give someone getting into this sport is don't get into it like you do trout fishing, thinking numbers. It's pretty much come out here. It's a beautiful time of the year to be out. 
We have great Indian summers and just come out on these rivers and enjoy the very act of being here. The fish are a bonus and the wild fish are even a better bonus than that. And just, I mean, we're sleeping in wall tents with wood stoves, uh, getting up early. We've been on the water since before daylight and you just have a good time. Boy, with this haze coming in, I think we should get up. I think it's, there's gonna be some fish moving through here That's pretty awesome. soon. Oh, geez. Lad's got one. Oh, look at the jump. As soon as this fish hit, it just zoomed downstream and it was in my back in no time. Oh! Oh! It's huge. It's huge. Steve and GL moved like finely tuned athletes, only a lot slower. It took them several minutes to Woo! negotiate the 200 yards. This thing's hot. Oh, it's oh, it's crazy, insane. It sounded like a, a little girl screaming downstream from us. And uh, we looked down and the steelhead was about four feet out of the oh! water. And lad oh! was rod this way, rod that way, reeling like a madman. And then we could hear the reel as the fish kept going. And uh, that was a, a native fish. And they don't always fight better, but seeing that much jumping, I was pretty sure it was going to end up being a native fish. And it was. I'm really fast as humanly possible. Wow, man. I saw three jumps. Oh, two others. Right? Yeah, oh yeah, it was just insane. Just insane. How'd he hit? Um, pretty much like a ton of bricks, I think. Yeah, I mean, he just went from nothing to playing a fish. <laughs> oh yeah, it's just, I, he jumped four times before I knew he even had one. <laughs> so, what a fish, huh? This steelhead's fishing just amazing. It's wild. Wow, what a wild, beautiful, man. oh, look at that flash. Okay, GL, coach me in here. Um, you're just gonna reel in at just about another foot. The tension wasn't over until GL had the steelhead firmly in his hands. Oh, nice. He's got a fish. Oh, yeah. GL, I had to admit, I thought you and Steve were in cahoots this whole time, but maybe you weren't. Wow. I quickly removed the fly. Yep, yeah, it's out. That's Man. Pretty. Mm -hmm. There's things get, and look at that big dorsal. <sighs> Good job. Yes. There we go. What a beauty. I'm gonna see. I think she's ready to go. Yep. Let her go. Very nice. If she takes Very my cool. fly again, I'll really be impressed. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, GL. Hey. That was awesome. Well, thanks, GL. That was an awesome trip. Caught some great steelhead today. Cool. Yeah, some days it's better to be lucky than good. <laughs> yeah. Today's one of those days. Yep. <laughs> Magic happens sometimes. <laughs> yep.